Where are you going? What? Daddy. Yeah. It's a whole other thing. He is feeding the dogs. Hello? Is everybody here? We have eight people. Okay. Okay, let's get the chair in here. What I'm do you eating Karnatsal. One second, please. Happy New Year, George Willigs. Okay, we're in. Push it over. All right. Hello, everybody. It might be a relatively shorter than normal Why? live stream because uh, the noise is going to come. The dog is going to poo in the house. Okay, so let's start and see who's here. We shall take some form of roll call. Kid is in the house. Adrian Piet. How's it going? Oops, a bit early. DSLR Dave. Imran Garushi. Yo. Juan Nunez. Dave uh, Viva Fries in the house. Whiskey Throttle. We in the house. These, we're going to have to close these little boxes up here. Uh, Edie Murphy's in the house. Blind Icon, Whiskey Throttle, DSLR Dave, DSLR Dave. Rachel Rawson, Edie Murphy we got. James Newland, James Newland. Did we do oh, Ben yeah. Beauregard, Rachel Rawson. Okay, I'm going to stop saying the same names over again. One Journal, Jeff and Pam. Whiskey Throttle, Did Blind Icon. Who did we do this one? Juan Nunes, yes. Frederick Clodino, hello, yeah. hello. Let's see what the dogs are here. Zero hour TV. Zero hour TV. Hectorious. Oh, Haven de Zuo. Where do you see that? <laughs> oh, yeah. Haven de, Haven de Zuo. Okay, so. Too spicy time. Rachel Ross. No, keep saying my name. <laughs> it's awesome. Hectorious, yay. And we got Rachel Ross. Okay, so. First things first, before I forget. Does everyone know that we are on uh, Instagram and Facebook and Twitter? Uh, under the Viva Fry on Twitter and Viva Fry, I probably should mention that in videos more often than not. Um, but I forget to mention it all the time. <laughs> Who wants to talk about what? Any questions? Let's take some questions. You are zero hour. We got Johnny B four nine three Sarah Bellum. Hey Mila, have your feet warmed up from the ice fishing yet? Yep. <laughs> oh, tell them about the big pike that I got. You got a big pike. I got a big pike. <laughs> Twitter ba yeah. ne next oh uh, okay we got cystical okay look at this look at this is this I'm telling you it's gonna be madness look here can we see that hey, look what oh happened. wait no look, what, look oh it doesn't matter okay she, did she did she poop under the table oh, she probably um Twitter va yeah Twitter I, I hate Twitter it's only good for trying to communicate with people uh, that you would otherwise not be able to communicate with. Does your wife really like ice fishing? Me thinks not. No, she does not like ice fishing, and she can't understand how I do it for hours on end. But um, Do you record audio and video separately? No, I don't, and today I had a series of problems because the audio didn't come out because it had a bunch of static in it taken off my camera, uh, and I lost the audio on like four or five that. different outtakes. Yeah, you can close that. I just went to my... Okay, you don't leave them, leave them all there. It's just going to... These windows just keep coming up. Um... So I don't know if everybody knows, but I'm going to go to Las Vegas tomorrow with the CES at the invite CES? of Gobo, Consumer Electronic Show. Apparently, because that's chief executive officer, two different things for two different entities. Um, it's in Vegas and apparently it's like, the, like a, a huge electronic show. I have a friend who goes consistently because he's in the toy industry. Um, and it's going to be fun. It's going to be, it's going to be amazing. Caden Young, Caden, we don't need super chat. Thank you very much. Buy the merchandise. Mm -hmm. Wait, Someone, I, my wife told me to ask you if your constant video videoing ever annoy your wife. I, I mean, I'm sure it does. Yeah. People. <laughs> Whiskey throttle. If if you're in a car traveling at the speed of light and turn your headlights on, will it make a difference? No, because you will be dead and disintegrated into a thousand billion particles. 
By the way, I'm so proud of your human curling. So proud. Oh yeah, that was that was really funny. My human curling. Uh, when I slid on the ice. The, I haven't put that video together yet. Uh, when we were out in the eastern townships, like an hour south of Montreal, the lake had just sort of melted and then frozen, and it hadn't snowed yet. So the lake was it amazing? Yeah. It was amazing. It was magical. It was like the only. It's like there's one or two days a year where that happens, where it melts, freezes, and then doesn't snow before it freezes hard and you can skate for miles on end. Fantastic. Um, do you record? And, and, but Haven, did you, I, there are tricks where I should record it with my iPhone, the audio in case the audio fails on the camera. Um, and I should start doing that because um, it, it becomes a big pain in the neck. Phantom Fake found a new word for the lasagna. How's your beach lasagna music video coming? Oh, the, the Phantom Fake. The beach lasagna, I think... Uh, is stale now. They've moved on to other things, although apparently the sub gap between uh, PewDiePie and T-Series is under a million now, which is getting back into risky territory, but uh, at the rate where they lose subs, it'll take uh, weeks to a month if nothing changes before T-Series takes over. But anyhow, they're all, they're, they've moved on to uh, more interesting things. Where, when are you going to start your fishing channel, Hectorius? The problem is there would be six months a year where we would be doing no fishing. Um, Why? Because it's winter. I mean, we would no, be doing it. Fish in the winter. Yeah, but we don't fish enough to have a channel unless it's just like one video a month. All that to say, the video of the skating on the ice and the perch fishing and the one where I caught that pike. I don't know if everybody saw that picture, but I caught a pike that got away and it was a big pike trying to flash a picture. Um, it had the hook in its mouth from the time it broke away. It was amazing. So that is going to make for an amazing uh, montage when I put the whole video together because it was skating, perch fishing, pike fishing. Um, Caden, buy the merchandise. Thank you very much. I should be putting the link to the merch in every video as a rule. I forget who told me to do that. I have to go back to my messages to find out, but I haven't done it and I've been very lazy. Um. Mikey Barnett, hi, happy Sunday. Are you ha happy holidays over? Are you happy holidays over? Are you happy Are holidays you over? Are you happy school start tomorrow? Yeah, there, we're going to have an intense back to school. Uh, and by we, I mean Marion, but we're going to have an intense back to school. Mila is back to school. Oh, the kids are all back to school tomorrow. Um, uh, the holidays are nice and, and they're wonderful and it's fantastic. Zero it's hours. just stressful being, it's stressful having to occupy kids all day long and not not her the younger ones who are difficult to entertain zero hour tv too fast kaden's out can see you later kaden can i make a video of me watching your video Z can i make a video of me watching your video uh, it depends it, 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 okay so i don't know if i told this story one of my videos got claimed by the news agency that was managing it as in what happened well i included a portion of my own video in, a, in, in another video and i got a copy strike from youtube because the news agency, one of them was handling that video and gave me a strike for using bits of my own video that they were handling. They removed the strike, but when a news agency is handling the video, they will automatically claim it if they see it being used somewhere else. So depending on how much is used or what audio is used or what visual is used, it might get claimed. Um, um, so that's you, the long answer to a short question. One? Who's question? A, uh, blind, blind icon. Blind icon. Uh, here's a question sent to your lawyer, Viva. If someone is driving but damages a wheel because of a deep hole in the road, um, would you be able to sue the city? There was one case in small claims that I'm aware of where someone actually successfully sued the city for rim damage because the city knew of the pothole and didn't fix it and it was there for months and it was huge and deep and negligent. But um, generally speaking, I think there is some sort of immunity for the city for those types of damages and there have to be uh, what's, I don't want to say circumstantial uh, um, facts, but... Oh. <coughs> Blind Icon was wondering, because it happened to one of his friends. Well, I, I know that there was one small claims case where, uh, in Quebec at least, where damages were awarded, but I think as a rule, you can't sue the city, but uh, don't, 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 don't take that to the bank in terms of legal advice. Uh, check with somebody. Also depends um, on jurisdiction. Um, Phantom Faye, do you make a living from YouTube? And um, John Cena says, your daughter is so cute. Please let her say hi to me. John, uh, John Cena, Lima is upstairs and Ethan's watching me. I think, I think Ethan might be upstairs. I was wondering since that happened to one of my friends, okay. Phantom Faye says, do you make a living from YouTube? Uh, not yet. Kinda. <laughs> a struggling one, a struggling existence. 
Where's your smaller daughter and son? They're they're out there playing around upstairs. That's an answer. Oh, e, uh, oh, and then we got Thomas Cahill. Evening, Thomas. What area are you located in? Are you in Canada? I think you're in Canada. Daddy, have you given the prizes? You should be charging for this legal advice. No, 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 no more, no more charging for legal advice. Am I doing a giveaway? Love your doggies, uh, Mikey Barnett. We'll do another giveaway sooner than later. We'll see what happens in Las Vegas because GoPro invited three people, three winners or three people who put clips in that video to go to Vegas for the CES. I was one of the three. The other two are, why are they making so much noise? The other two were one of the guys who touched the yellow tip of the wing and the, of, the, and the of the wing of the plane. And the guy swimming with the dolphins with the underwater wingsuit is gonna be there. So three of us, we'll see what happens. Um, fingers crossed we'll make some connections and be able to do something good for a partnership uh, um, Dad, have you, this year. I didn't hear, did you give uh, the prizes for the giveaway yet? Oh, I sent out the prizes actually. I hope uh, that um, his name was, not his real name, but his screen name. Anyways, uh, the GoPro was delivered. The I sent the box to somebody. I hope they got it. The other one who won the box said don't ship it because they were in Eastern Europe, I believe. And if anyone uh, won a shirt and didn't get it, let me know. And now someone's at the door. This is going to get mayhem. Go, you go see who's there. Uh, Trinidad. Where do you go to school? London, UK. Okay, very cool. Hey, from Trinidad. How cool is that? Hi, Rachel. Karen Somers is in the house. Laugh my, laugh my, LMAO, that dog wants some camera time. Oh, it's a, it's, it's a tricky one. Now we have um, a, a, a friend's kid, a kid friend, a friend. There's a parent for one of our kids in the house. I may have to take this into the kitchen. Is that what the is, Mom? I know. We're going to go in here. Did Marion leave? Marion was in the kitchen. Okay, we're in the kitchen. If the connection is slow, let us know. Okay. <laughs> um, Trinidad always locked on strong, Rachel Rawson. Okay, so um, what did we say we were going to talk about that might have been of interest? What? If you could be the most successful YouTuber or lawyer, which would you choose and why? Phantom Fay, the mo I would choose to be hands down, without a question, the most successful YouTuber because it involves doing the things I love. Um, and it opens the doors that I want to be open, which is uh, being able to interview people with interesting stories who would otherwise not really pay any attention to me if I'm a small YouTuber who tries to get an interview. Do you guys hear the dogs out there? This is crazy. There's going to okay. be poo smeared all over the floor. Having these you, one thing that I've noticed from your videos is that you haven't created a unique culture in your videos that... What I mean is that most YouTubers have a name for their subs and an ongoing culture. Yes, I know. This is one of the pillars of marketing. Uh, Jablinski, for anyone who's been watching him with his three videos, his last video, Jables. I believe he calls his, his subscribers Jables. I haven't done it yet. It feels artificial and phony to me. And I had tried, uh, what do I call the Frysters? I tried the Frysters. It feels awkward and forced and unnatural and also like I'm objectifying the subscribers by giving them a name that's after me, like George Foreman naming all of his kids George Jr. George we'll see, one, we'll see two, if we can do it. Three, do you have any cooking videos coming up? Love seeing the what connections, you, what concoctions you come up with, Sarabellum. I've been meaning to do a cooking video. I what was I going to cook the other day? Mm -hmm. I was going to I was going to do a lasagna cooking video. <laughs> if you know what I mean, <laughs> we'll see if we can do it. Um, have you thought of doing commentary videos on YouTube topics? Lord Chifero. I do those occasionally. Tomorrow's video, by the way, is going to be very funny because um, for anybody who doesn't know the Legal Eagle guy that I keep referencing, uh, who I watch his channel, he does law review videos. He did a video today as to whether or not Game Theorist copied him in his review or analysis of the Fortnite 2 milli lawsuit. And the funny thing is, he said, the funny thing is he says that he's positing that game theorist copied his video because the similarities in the analysis of the legal question and game theorist video came a week later. Well, um, legal Eagles video came one and a half weeks after my video and the similarities between all of oh ours gosh, are similar. It's, so it's funny. Good. It's funny. Anyway, videos coming tomorrow. Check it out. It'll be good. Hello yeah, from Toronto. Wait, uh, Dom, Dom's nine money wants a shout out. Who? 
Don, Don V9 Money. Can I get a shout out? You have been shouted out, sir. Twice. And we got Aussie Man 420. 420. No, no, no. What? That's a, it's a drug reference. Um, Fry Nation. Nah, Juan Nunes, that's too close to Philly DeFranco's nation. We didn't hear a kid cry. Um, hello from Toronto. I love watching your videos. What kind of video do you like making the most? Uh, I love the fishing videos because it gives me an excuse to compulsively fish until I catch something. And the fishing is the quietest time of my life uh, these days. Do you have a term for friends? Like how PewDiePie said bros. That could be authentic terminology. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Oh, boy. He's naked. He's naked. Wait. He's got to get out of here. No, okay, I well, need some ice. You need some ice. What happened? Sunker, get, get him some ice. Ethan, what happened? Okay, so we got to keep Ethan, the camera pointed up. Ethan fell off the stairs. Ethan fell off the stairs. Um, uh, I'll think of a Viva Nation. No, so hold on. Maybe something I call my friends. I call okay. them dudes. Like, what do I? Oh, maybe fry dudes? Fry dudes, but then that's ex that's not inclusive because dudes are generally is a male terminology. Yeah. We can have fry. Dude, fry dude. Fry. Well, I was called fry balls as a kid. Fry balls, <laughs> but fry balls, but that would be too close to jables. Uh, okay, we got a kid who's lying on the bed. Are you wearing? Um, are, <laughs> the kids are not. The kids are not dressed for some reason. No, no, you got. You really have to. Hello. Okay, she's in. No, she's in. She's covering herself up now. But go, go get a shirt on, please. Okay. Okay, she's, that's enough. That's good, that's good enough. Uh, she's in a um, mermaid. mermaid, a mermaid thingy. Frysters, Frysters. I think I like Frysters. We could do Frysters. That is a great room. The kitchen, Don Nine V. This is our kitchen. We didn't touch it since we got the house. And we're redoing it. Yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll we what are because we already got the permits. We got the permits, but there's much more to life than the Viva Frame Framley. Framley. How about Davidians? Elo, yeah, David. Well, how about I? Was, we'll call them all. Frysters, I think, might be good, but Frysters might be too close to shysters. Shysters. Shysters is not a good word. Um, Viva Friars, Viva Friars. Okay, so what else do we got here? The Viva family. Okay, we can be Frysters. It might be Frysters. We may have just done it. Frysters unite. <laughs> um. Okay, so what else? Um, Anyone else have questions? Let's do. Let's just do questions. Hmm. I'm Viva Fry. I'm going to periodically remind people. Like, oh, did I mention I was on Twitter and Facebook yes. and Instagram? <laughs> the Viva Fry on Twitter. It's terrible, my Twitter handle, but my Instagram account is quite nice, I believe. The Friars. We're frying stuff. Friars, the Friars. Look at Blind Icon. Whoa, what is that? Uh, that's a guy doing this. Oh. Whoa, that is so cool. Yeah, it takes a lot. If you just cut and paste, I think we can cut. Yeah, we can cut and paste it. Let's just see if we do that. Copy, and then I go here. Booyah! Oh! <laughs> That's cool. Um, Vivinators. Kevin Fair, how's it going, Kevin? Um, I Well, you have to make it. you got to do a dash and some thing and some symbol. I don't know how they do it. Uh, hello from Norway. I'm a father myself. You inspire yeah. me to be a better father. Thank you. Aussie man, thank you very much. Hey, Aussie I man, wait, it. he's an Aussie man from Norway? What? Um, I, was, I, I have to make a video of my confessions about being a parent, like the things that are upsetting or the things that, the difficulties of being a parent that maybe some people don't talk about, but everybody generally feels. Uh, I've, been, I've been tinkering with that one in my head for a while. Um, when I have some time, I'll... Okay, get on. Stop doing it. I'm that. trying to make the... We'll do it, lady. You'll, pra you'll, you'll practice. Australia, Brett Pearson's in the house. Uh, so Aussie man, thank you. But um, we have we all have our moments and we have our ups and downs. Um, I have made a conscious decision not to exploit the downs because a lot of I don't know some channels try to build drama on the unpleasant parts or the hard parts of being a parent that everybody knows exist. But I don't want to exploit the bad stuff or like I've always said, I don't want to put stuff up there that's not that the kids are going to not be happy about uh, in a decade or in, in a half a decade. Four and three minutes. Um, Silent Wolf says, I get that. Silent Wolf Adventures. That's the man we did the channel review on last week or a few days ago. What's Phantom going Faces on with the, Ma with the Madden's channel? You're slacking. Hold on. What I have to make a, a thing. <laughs> She's slacking. I'm slacking because she needs to do her, her rewind for 2018, but it requires getting a minute from every video that she's posted. Not a minute. Like okay, 30 seconds. seconds. And he won't let me use his computer. The work, 
the work is the same in my computer. My beautiful computer. Nobody touches my computer. Um, so anyways, I, it's my fault. I have to help her get the video up. But when I go take my computer, she can't edit because the software is on my computer. Um, yeah. We got Solomon Ventures. Hey, hey, baby Gojo says, hi there, Solomon Ventures. But I'm going to be building like two videos really close to each other because I have a loose tooth. Oh, yes. She has a loose tooth. Look. I think... Yeah, it's a loose. I think we might do it tonight. No. We might do it tonight. We might be doing, there might be uh, a double whammy coming up this week, but that's a loose tooth right there. Okay, so let's see. Phantom Face seems to have another legal question. I was paying for my phone bill for two years after my contract ended. What are the odds I can get the money back? What do you think? There's one principle, he who pays wrong pays twice, uh, but there's also no reason why they should have been collecting the payment and they should voluntarily give you the money back. There are also consumer protection laws that apply depending on your jurisdiction. Look up consumer protection laws. Uh, no reason why anyone should have been taking automated payments after your contract ended, but then not knowing the actual details. I don't know if your contract fully ended. I don't know if you were paying for a service that you weren't using, blah, blah, blah. Too many ifs in the words of this. Okay. What if you're... Oh, wait. No, Kevin Fair, call on the squirrels. Say it again. Call them, the Call them the squirrels. Well, the squirrels are sort of hibernating, but uh, we have a plan. Just rip it out now. Oh, a live stream tooth pull? No. <laughs> Give me the tooth. Give me the tooth. <laughs> um, what's, what's your way to get rid of a loose tooth quickly? What's my go-to way? We've tried so many things. I tried to attach a dental floss to the wheel of a blender to whip it out with the blender, but it kept on coming off. We did that? I, I tried that once. Forgot that one. How many videos do you post a day? Seems like you post twice a day sometimes. Bobby Gojo's. I haven't posted twice a day in a while. Um, and I've been said I was going to slow down and post less frequently, but then like, you know, I have these short videos that I just want to share. And I always have this fear of dying before I get my video out. Um, so I end up, yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. With a drone we've done, Brett. Check out the one with the drone. We've done it twice with the drone. We did it with uh, a little flying fairy. Uh, one of those like flying fairies, but it was sort of a, a trick. Did, that, did I put that video up? I don't think he did. Okay. Um, wait, yeah, you did. Um, uh, wait, just checked in to say hi and like, you know, hit the like button. Watching football. Oh, watching what is the mystery video. brand? Okay. What? Jeremy Anthony. Where's Jeremy Sorry, Anthony? Everyone press the button. Oh, yeah. But, yeah. Hi and, oh, J Jeremy Anthony's in the house. He says, just check in, say hi, like people like the, people hit the like button watching football, we'll watch later. Jeremy, thank you for tuning in. Jeremy takes football very seriously, um, and rightly so, I guess. I haven't, I only watch one game a year and it's the Super Bowl. Yeah, Super Bowl. And like an idiot. I, I just found the book where, um, remember the Oh, when we went to a friend's house, the... we went to a friend's house for the Super Bowl and someone was substituted the word, a swear word with trucker. No, no, we actually said it. Well, whatever. It, We're saying it was fantastic. Sorry. Um. Doorknob slam, that one always works. Look up some doorknob fails. No. Okay, so hold on a second. Cute Spicy Ty says, what's with the mystery brand in the description? Did I miss something? Mystery brand was the controversy of the week and I was going to make a video on it, but I watched a couple of videos and I don't think I'm gonna have anything new to add to the discussion, but it was um, a guy named Rice Gum, who I know of his, his name is Rice Gum. He's a YouTuber, Jake Paul. Mm -hmm and some other British kid who did these videos endorsing something called Mystery Brand, which is basically an online gaming site where you pay money to open boxes and in the boxes they have toys. And then there was a controversy that they're, that these YouTubers who know that they have young audiences are, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Promoting gambling to the young audiences and big ripoff, objective ripoff scams of a, of a okay. website. What is new? Uh, we'll get back to Mystery Brand in a second. What's up? Have you wa no, that's not it. Tell the folks to share this video too. Uh, zero hour TV two five six. Um, what is the best advice for someone who is new on YouTube like me, Bobby Gogios? Bobby Gogios, the best advice on YouTube is okay. Not to be tacky and pull the Casey advice, which is just keep uploading. Um, upload. I would say I, the best advice is don't put something up there that you're going to regret just for the sake of getting noticed. Uh, what is, uh, no. Hey guys, m hey guys, Milo, what's your favorite thing about Canada? What What about you, Ooh, Milo? What's, the, what's your favorite thing about Canada, eh? <laughs> Fishing, Canada, I lo the outdoors, I the nature. Yeah, there's, there's nothing, it's outdoors. The clean air when you get out of the cities, of the multicultural cities, the beautiful European Montreal, uh, Toronto. 
I'm joking. Okay, that's that's not. We don't. I, I don't like Toronto very much, but um, it's it's certainly the outdoors. Uh, Ontario is magnificently beautiful. British Columbia is beautiful. Oh, British Columbia is outrageous. Outrageous. Um, wait. Um, where we wait, like, share. We can be? So ice yes, hockey is better than football. Share this video. Viva silence until we got 200 viewers. Um, uh, How do you share the video? Adventures streaming. I have an ancient laptop. Uh, what would be a cheap go-to I can expand on an email or something, but that's the sort of version. I, tech stuff I'm no good with. Um, I, I, I fought Macs for the longest time, and then I finally got a Mac, and I'll never go back to a PC. Um, no, but I don't know. You'd have to. I would. I would. I would look. Go look at um, MK. MK. MKB. Oh, don't worry with that. MK. What's his name? Marquez. Marquez Brownlee. His channel. It's MKBHD. I would check out him and see what he says for for those types of answers. I'm not a tech guy. Um, my favorite thing about Canada is Viva Fry. That's Kevin. Oh, that's very nice, Kevin. Fair. Whiskey Throttle says consistency. Yep, consistency. But even you can be inconsistent. I just think the issue is. Um, is not abusing your subscribers or not taking advantage of your subscribers or not uh, upsetting, you, not insulting, degrading, or uh, duping your subscribers um, through your content. Um, and that's it. Okay. Um, Everyone share this video. The wide-angle black and Duke. white forest picture is real cool on the white ramp. I took that one. I took the oh, whole let's, let's get close to that picture. This is a picture I took uh, in Mont-Tremblant Park. And the white ram, um, it's a very rare uh, species of ram that we hunted for in the land of porcelain. Uh, I don't know where that came from. Question for both of you. Will you let your most embarrassing stories, will you share your most embarrassing stories? Uh. Will you tell your most embarrassing stories? I have never had an embarrassing moment in my life. Except that one time I sneezed and boogers came out of my nose all over the place in front of the girl that I liked most. Really? No, no. That happened to someone else, actually. No. <laughs> um, it doesn't matter. You don't know who it is. The person. You never met the person. Uh, the so hold on a second. Hold on a second. Mind. The accent is my favorite. Yeah. You know, the, I, Canada's, Canada's an amazing place because we, we are not yet destroyed in terms of our humor as to what we accept as humor. And we have edgy humor compared to the United States. We don't live in the same sort of perpetual fear of... of of, of, of in, being inhibited in the humor that we have. Uh, we used to have like racy television shows that were on in prime time. We have swearing on our television shows occasionally. It's good. We have a, uh, Canada's an awesome place. Question for both of you. Okay, the embarrassing one. What is your favorite? What? Okay, sorry. Ozzy Man says, my favorite is your new laws. Which ones? Question for both of you. Just have some fun on YouTube. Oh, we're, we're, we need to go back down here. Um, Ajinx is in the house. Hi, hi. Bobby Gorgeous says, I'm signing off. Thanks for hanging out. Ciao. I'm procrastinating so much right now. Bobby, see you later. How much show will we get? We're at 27 minutes. Goodbye. Um, oh, Asana says, that's so amazing. I see your lawyer fast talk kick in. Um, <laughs> okay, so where are we at now? So proud of you. Canada, Godspeed. This is Rachel Rawson. Don V. Money, how many fishes have you caught? How many fish have I caught? I've caught so many fish. <sighs> beaver fish pike sunfish bass uh catfish no i love fishing fishing oh, i mean i love i guess fishing is my mo i would say fishing is my favorite part of canada but i can do that in the states also dislike if you hate this sophia frost 2026 dislike if you hate this what? is she is she talking about she's talking about our channel what oh the one that got away yeah solemn wolf i caught the fish the, the fit, that pike picture that I posted on Instagram and Facebook is the pike that snapped off our line the first time. Then I put a wire leader on and I hand lined that pike in. It was amazing. Was it amazing? Uh, it was amazing. Uh, oh, not just uh, okay. Same with Sarah Frost. Um, uh, Sarah Frost, Sophia Frost. Don't worry about it. I was, uh, wasn't serious. Okay. So while we have a low, we got Benia Shagiv here says, Hey, you, how are the fries? How are the fries? <laughs> That's us. We're good. Delicious. We're a little stressed out because, uh, we're what a little was stressed the first out. Fish you caught? What was the first fish I caught? It was probably a perch up in St. Donna, St. Agath area off our dock. Wait, how do I make that little face again? I went like this. So then have to... Okay, we're done with that no. fish. Now. What was the first fish I caught? What's your favorite beer? Okay, so we have a lot of fortified beer in Quebec. I don't like drinking beer because it upsets my stomach, but my favorite beer, hands down, is Lefe or Fain du Monde or Mozit. We Okay, we have a tradition and a long inspiration of Belgian beer in Quebec from all the, what are they called? The, um, oh, Abbey. What are the Abbey in English? If someone can help me. 
where the monks used to go to pray and where they make beer. Okay, whatever. Fain du Monde is one of our strong fortified beers. It's called the End of the World or Mozit, which is a French swear word. Fantastic beers. You can, I think you can get them everywhere, but they're, they're well known in Quebec. Okay. Uh, if your name is Fry and you speak French, are you a French fry? Oh. Uh, oh. Matt, do you read a uh, vid shared? As far as I can see, close the chat and then... And that and that takes you back to the main menu beneath the video. Share is then an option high any of my FB friends. That's what Facebook friends. Okay, whatever. Share the video. Let's take thirty seconds to share. I am have a sh too late, too boring. We can't play the waiting game. Um, oh, I, like I speak for I speak for all well-rounded Cuban Americans when I say we love Canada and its people. Thank you, Juan. I dare you to pause. <laughs> That was a freeze. Did you ever want to be taller? I know I still, Rachel, I, I got used to my height. I, it's also good because you can hide under things and move, maneuver yourself better. Plus, uh, yeah, I, I have no problem being short. Did you used to play sports when you were younger? Brett Pearson. Yeah, I used to, we were very active. Uh, judo, I used to play football, wrestling. Did you used to play sports? Um, rugby in high school, wrestling in high school. Uh, oh, no, squash. I used, to play, I used to play varsity squash in McGill. Who is? Kevin Fair. Kevin, see you later. Ciao. No pauses. Hashtag no pauses. A monastery. So that's it. Now I think they. I think we. I think we have some influence from monasteries in terms of our beer. But we have we have uh, fortified beers in Quebec. They're fantastic. Isn't it great to speak two French languages? Juna. Uh, Juan Nunes. Yes, speaking two language at least two languages is an absolute asset, you. invaluable asset. Have you ever heard? Have you ever had a sponsor for your videos? Uh, no real official sponsors. I got paid for one. Oh, I got paid. I, I had a, I, I got a contract with the city to do one of the um, uh, the events for Montreal's 375th birthday, where they I was paid to do a vlog, and it was it was fantastic. I got to go do the dance, uh, Artonic dance, uh, and then another one uh, got paid to show how to how to use a, a product. Um, I just wanted nice long legs. This is Rachel <laughs> lamenting about not being tall enough. Yeah, you know what? But then you get nice long legs and then you have other issues like nice long legs to shave. And if you don't shave them, they get all hairy. And then you have like toenails that get too long. Every, every, everything, there's good things and bad things about everything. Oh, let me take a shower. I speak, Karen Thomas says, I speak three languages, Dutch, English, and German. Yeah, it's, it's incredible to speak multiple languages. Do I think Stephen Avery is innocent? I, I don't know who Stephen Avery is offhand. What did he do? But if he's that guy that, uh, if he's that guy, I don't want to talk about him. Who, who, what did Stephen Avery do? Don't, I'll Google it later. No. No, nah, I don't Stephen know. Avery did. What was he accused of doing? Can you show us that photo on the back of the wall? Yeah, Benia Shigiv is late. I'll show it again. Here, let's just go back and I'll tell the story behind this. I went for a hike with my best friend and favorite who? dog, who? Smitty and Winston. And we got lost in the woods and in this tremendous fog, we couldn't find our way back. And then we got lost and stuck because we got to an edge of a cliff that we couldn't walk down with the dog. And then we had to go detour endlessly to get out of there. Murdering a whole lot. Phantom, is he the guy who, with his wife and his kids and they have video of him taking everybody out of the house? Uh, I try to fill my head with nice thoughts these days. Oh, the making a murder. I haven't seen that. I haven't seen that, but I know enough about it. But no, no comments. What is it? What is I, it's it? a it's a documentary uh, about somebody. Whiskey oh. throttle. Thank you very much. Buy some Innis and gun aged whiskey barrels. Well, I am convinced. Thank you very much, whiskey. Um, I'm convinced I'm going to be able to find um, proper number. What is it? Proper number twelve. Proper number twelve in Vegas. I'm, I'm thoroughly convinced. So oh, expect a video. Money. The money. <laughs> So I'm thoroughly convinced I'm going to finally get proper number 12 in Vegas. Beer, age, and whiskey. Mm. Sounds good. You're too young. <laughs> you wait another 15 years. Um, beautiful photo. Thank you very much. Where is the best place to fish in Montreal or its surroundings? It depends how far you want to go. Where my mother-in-law lives and I catch all those pike, it's 45 minutes out of town. Um, uh -huh. There's the Lachine Canal where I've never actually caught anything, but I've seen people catch sturgeon, pike, not pike, sorry, bass, uh, perch. Uh, Caden, man. Caden. I always thought... That was a, t a TV on screen saver. <laughs> no, no, no. That's just a, it's a printed on canvas. I've had it there for years. Printed? Printed on canvas oh, to photograph. Yeah. Uh, how much do you charge for advertising? See, I have never done it yet. I'll see what happens when it happens because I'm just waiting for my first, like, outright sponsored ad where I am get to do, like, the PewDiePie thing. Like, can we ah. support to ourselves? 
We don't need to give support to ourselves. Yeah, money. Don't, don't, don't worry. We need to support you. We need to work. That's what we have to do. How do you, how much do you charge? For, so I don't know how much to charge for advertising. We'll see. We'll get, we'll have our question when we get there. Um, that's it. Okay. So let's see. Uh, needs more subs because I tried to slow the live stream down to normal speed. And a pair is already at normal speed. Yes. I'll bring in my lawyer mode and start talking slowly. This is so irritating for me and the wheels speeding. I'll send you a dollar to show my picks. Well, what are the picks of Zero Hour TV? <laughs> uh, whiskey Throttle 33 to 26. Okay. Um, what, yeah. what, what Eating Murphy. What he, he, uh, whiskey, uh, not whiskey, sorry, Zero Hour. Send me some. Send me some photographs. Anyhow, I I, I don't need to get paid for that. I, I I like showing other people's talents. Um, in terms of photography, they have His to be smiles. they have to be crowd appropriate pictures. That is smiles. My smiles. Okay. Let's, oh, let us. I'm curious now. Send me an email. David at beaverfry.com. If ever I I've said this before, but if ever I forget to get to back to people, please uh, forgive me in advance. Um. Okay. So hold on. What else did we forget? We got 25 likes and 31 people watching. That's very nice. That's good. That's, that's just, I, I like these things. I like live streams. Um, Even though when some people your little girl. How, how's school going? Favorite things to do in school? Oh, my favorite thing, gym. It's, gym is everybody's favorite thing in school. Gym yeah. and science. Science. Science I, is awesome. Science is in French, so it's terrible. Do you want to go see where mom is and make sure that she's not going crazy? No. Go check. Go check and make sure everything's okay. I've left. Uh, I've left my Marion with uh, Mom? with the kids. So let's just make sure that everybody's okay. Oh, Nick Fam TV's in the house. Hey friends, hope you are all well. We are well and we are here. Jim is everyone's favorite. Oh, this is at zero hour. Yep. Science. I'm doing something. Everything's good. I don't know. Okay. Uh, I love. Si this is uh, Sarah Bellum says science was the best in school. Yep. Brett Pearson, I loved science in junior school, but then I had a horrible teacher in middle and hated it. Um, Rachel Rawson says, Micah. Nick Pham says, Eddie Murph Edie Murphy, hi there. Um, so the mystery brand, to get back to that, just to close off the loop, the controversy is that these guys are targeting bad stuff, scam gambling websites to young subscribers and getting paid buttloads of money. I mean, hundred thousand plus dollars to do the video. Yeah. What? Um, so then there's that, that was a controversy. I had nothing to add to it. A lot of people did more research and I was going to add nothing new other than picking from everybody else's video. So I uh, said I would skip on doing it. More sub says some people like art best. No names. Oh, I, like I, art. I art. Art is also fantastic. Art was oh, my favorite in high school. Uh, heart Rose 33 says we can be called your little friends. <laughs> heart Rose. I haven't seen you in a while. I don't think I remember. I remember seeing you a lot in, I haven't seen you in a while, as, unless I've missed something. But good to see you again. Heart Rose is there. Well, some people like art. Yes, Blonde, like Viva Las Vegas. It's going to be a blitz in and out of Las Vegas, but it's going to be phenomenal. Um, I would love to see to you do a series analyzing Making a Murderer, which has courtroom footage. Uh, the problem with that, that, I think that would upset me too much. Um, Why? It's, it's upsetting. It's objectively upsetting. What's it about? It's a guy who gets con arrested, convicted of murder. Then they find out that the prosecuting attorneys and the police were hiding evidence, were coercing evidence out of, out of people who had disabilities. And then uh, they release the guy. And then it, the whole, it's a whole big thing. It's, 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 it shows the corrupt legal system uh, and uh, a corrupt judicial system. It's upsetting. Uh, so it's, TV says Freisters. Freisters. What do we, I think, did we all agree? We, we said Freisters was what we said yeah. before, right? Okay, Nick fam, I think, I think we might have agreed on Freisters. See if I feel. Oh, <laughs> oh you're playing with your tooth. <laughs> that would have been funny if it's an accidental tooth pull. Uh, wait, what Me too, Viva, I can't stand injustice. Yeah, no, it's like, it's, it's, um, yeah, it's too much. It's actual people's lives. What will it take to go, to go a full-time YouTuber. Uh, it takes steady income, it takes sponsorships, and it takes it takes predictable income. <gasps> Whoa! What happened? G Zinger 1 is from Niagara. Niagara Falls, Ontario. Amazing place. They have an amazing casino out there. They have yes. Niagara Falls is beautiful. Um, like, Niagara. right next to it, can you hear it? 
It might do, be like after us. Hey, Jay Zinger, do you live right next to it? And can you hear the waterfalls? No, but oh, I have an amazing picture that I took from Niagara Falls. I'm gonna find it and post it. Remind me, it's a it's a bird flying over the waterfalls with a um. You a went rainbow to Niagara Falls without you. Because you were not even born yet. Uh, congrats on 45K. Why almost 50. Yep. Born, Nick fam, I'm, I'm getting there. It's, that's, it's fantastic. I'm hoping that I'm going to get a, a massive, not a massive spike, but uh, some increased exposure from what's going to happen in Vegas because it will be a new crowd. It will be a new platform. Um, I'm gonna, apparently, I'm going to be on a panel, me and the two other guys who uh, were, the two other people, I don't know if they're guys, who were invited to attend this conference. <laughs> They might have been, but I just don't know. Um, but apparently the, th the two other people who were invited to attend the conference were going to be on a panel on stage with Nick Woodman. And I forget the name of the person who directed the video, but it's going to be like a Q&A panel with Nick Woodman on a stage. So hopefully, uh, you know, I'll be able to expose my YouTube channel and YouTube and career. Mine, and mine. Oh, yes, yes. I'll be sure to plug Mila while I'm up there. Just <laughs> you say, and I have th a free... Two dollars and what's on... What is a YouTube channel called Mila's Madness? Go subscribe right now. Are you pros? Yeah. What... What you claim? Oh, hold on, so we missed something here. Congrats on 45K. So it is, that's what I'm saying. Hopefully Vegas, I'll be able to launch my YouTube channel to a, a platform, a whole slew of people who have never heard of it, and there'll be some growth, but we'll see. One way or another, there's gonna be great content coming out of Vegas. Oh, um, and it'll be amazing. Zinger is 10 minutes away from That's Niagara. fantastic. So you can't hear it, but maybe you can see it. I wanna go to Niagara Falls when it freezes over once, because it happens every, I don't know, what they say, seven years or something. I just skipped back. Uh, oh, okay, hold on one second. We got Robert John Care. hi. Just skip back. Did we chat about GoPro yet? We did. We were, I think we were just on it there. Um, but I'm going to, oh, comments coming in here. Uh, ah! What you, uh, 10 minutes away. Benita, what is my best photo? My best photo is the duck photo with its wing touching the water. Um, I'm going to post these. Remind me to post these on Twitter and the Instagram and Facebook. The next time you go ice fishing, why don't you give me a shout? I'm on the way to Lake Champlain. Tous Who said this? Tous les motards. Oh, yeah, man, dude, we're out, we're out in Venise on Quebec um, uh, on the lake there all the time. It's fantastic. CES conference in Vegas. Oh, yeah, this is for Nick Fam. We're go I'm going to go to the CES conference, the Consumer Electronics Show in Vegas. Uh, and apparently uh, Marquez Brownlee is going to be there. I'm going to, I'm going to find Marquez Brownlee uh, in a non-stalking manner because Vegas has a stricter... Um, Laws than Canada. <laughs> I'm joking. I don't know, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna try to. I'm, I'm obviously. I'm gonna try to meet up with with Marquez Wait. Brownlee, even if he doesn't know who I am and probably doesn't want to meet me. I uh, got to think creative and find a way to meet him that does not come off as scary. Need more sub? Why don't you? Why did you wait for me to be born? High five. I oh wait. We'll go back. We'll go back to to Niagara Falls. It's a Holiday Inn at Catherine's Holiday Inn. Oh, this is a this is a Niagara Falls. Um. We'll see. I think we know. Oh, I, think I love the holiday there. ends. Because I have no pets and pools. Okay, so let's see. Oh, oh and we got, we got, who's this, Avi? Who? Avi? Is that a cousin? Oh. Is that a nephew, Avi? No. Let's see. We'll see. It's, a, it's, a, it's an icon I've never seen before. Whose vlogs are better, Casey Neistat or David Dobrik? Who? Uh, Dobrik, you don't watch very often. I don't watch Dobrik oh, very yeah, often. Oh, yeah, it's her. Rock on, Abby. And your nephew. My nephew, your cousin. <laughs> um, I prefer Casey Neistat to David Dobrik, but um, uh, but it's strictly a question of content and style, but I don't think one's better than the other. Jay Zinger is saying Catherine way better. Deal, contact me. Okay, so so I just sent one of my Hero 7 Black. Still got one. Should I wait for a fix in firmware? Your advice, please. Wait, what's the problem, uh, Robert John Care? Jay Zinger, if we're ever there, if we're in St. Catharines, I, I, you know, we're gonna do we're gonna do the cross country YouTube, what? the YouTube video. That would be so cool. Uh, to your girl, Aussie man, how is it to be the biggest sister? What? How is it to be a big oh, sister? Oh me, it's annoying. It is annoying. It is annoying because she and I'll answer this for her because I feel her pain. <laughs> She is always the one that has to compromise. She's always the one that has to give up her seat. She's always the one that has to give more of her food away because the younger kids don't understand the concept of fairness, equity, equality. They don't understand when the TV has to go off. And then it's the parent who gets frustrated at the oldest one because they're the only ones who are able to understand these concepts. I was the youngest of five. I still am the youngest of five, so I got it from the exact opposite. Uh, oh, wait. Um uh, we're gonna go. Oh, oh yeah, so Abby wants to know why you couldn't let him win. 
for that. Yeah, Abby. Even if you had won, you would. I would have. You would have not gotten it. No, Viva, do serious I question. A why? Do I hold on? Oh, oh, why couldn't you? Because you cannot have family members winning in ra cheating. random contests. It's going to look corrupt. And th this is a fundamental principle of justice. Even if it is not corrupt, it has to avoid the appearance of corruption. Having judges judge their family is impossible, even if they are in fact impartial, because it gives the semblance of partiality. So that's the reason. Okay, Rachel Ross and Viva, serious question. Do I buy a GoPro or GoPro Fusion 360 camera? Personally, I would just buy a GoPro 7. I would not buy a 360 oh. camera. It is, I, I wouldn't want to worry about all of the editing, the platform upload issues. Straightforward camera. It's like, it's the basics. I have a feeling 360 is not, I'm going to go out on a limb uh, and maybe I'm going to be wrong in 10 years time, but there's something to be said about the simplicity oh. of a pointing and Blind shooting of a camera. Icon Blonde Icon, you're out of here? Peace out. Stay here. We're not going anywhere. We we should we could do another few minutes, but then I think we should probably go because we left Marion with the two difficult um, uh, children to deal with at this point in time of their age, not because of personality. Oh, Phantom Abby face, oh, emailed you an outro. Oh, my nephew emailed me an outro. Let's see what this what looks like. Me? You have to give me one too. <laughs> You'll learn something of the currency of subscribers. Avi, my nephew. Avi, what's your YouTube channel name? <laughs> Doesn't you share it with Random Dude? I, I don't know. But anyways, it, but my nephew also has a has a YouTube channel. Avi. Oh, if Avi you're there, po next. Okay, good. Avi, post the link to your YouTube channel so people can see uh, you and Random yeah, Dude's it, channel. It, it's the same one. I have water. Uh, it's Random Okay, Har Hargo says, I have water from the journey behind the falls and put it in the glass maple leaf. Syrup bottles, yeah, that's cool. That's like collecting water, collecting sand is always fun, but then you see bacteria grow. Uh, Jeremy right. Anthony says, plug it. That's right. Robert John Kerr. So I had to both freeze, send one back. I'm, I'm oh, so it's, it's, I'm having some issues with my GoPro, but they're battery issues, and they're especially bad when it's cold. And I don't know if it's because I'm using my old GoPro 5 batteries with the new GoPro 7, um, but I'm noticing battery issues, but that's the only issue I've had so oh, far. Uh, zero Hour TV 256, more veggie meat recipes. Uh, do you mean veggie and meat? That's a typo. More veggie and meat recipes. We can do that. Okay, we may have to go. We may have to go. Go see what mom is doing and ask her if she wants us to come. We may, uh, we may, be, um, we may be calling this one in soon, people. Ah! Freisters. Uh, I hear a kid screaming in the other room, and I, and I bet there is dog poo out there. I heard the question, do you want daddy to end soon? Which is a loaded leading question. Let's just hear what the answer was. She's coming back. She's coming back. Ethan doesn't want me to talk to him. Mom wants you to end soon. Uh, Ethan wasn't screaming at mom. He was screaming at something. We are hungry. Okay, hungry. so we're gonna we're gonna end this. Let's give it uh, three minutes. At fifty minutes, we're ending this. But let's just do this here. We got Andre Giovanni Art and Dyslexia. Hi. Hello from Bosnia. Oh, hello. So you want to come up here? Hello from Bosnia. That's fantastically cool. Um, Bosnia and Herzegovina. Andre. Hello, hello. Ethan's in the house. Ethan's. In okay, sorry. Sorry. Um. Okay. Okay, so hold on, we're losing it here. Uh, Nick Pham says, yes, Richard. Okay, what do you think about vegans? No, no, I'm not vegans. I have nothing against anybody. I have nothing against anybody who is not mm -hmm. impeding or hurting oh, other people man. with their life decisions. Uh, vegans, I don't have the discipline to do it. I'm not sure that it's as healthy Daddy, from a purely Daddy, basic level. Daddy. Yes? How? <laughs> that is That is hair. Why? Uh, I, I, why? Uh, because when you hit puberty, hair starts to grow out of your face. It's a miracle thing. What? Okay, loving your channel. Talk against you, Robert. Out of here. Why Peace out. Hair on face. Why hair on my face? Because yeah. I hit. Okay. Because and, he has puberty. <laughs> please, more cooking. Yeah, we're gonna one. There's gonna be more cooking guaranteed. He wants carnazzo. Go get him some carnazzo. Give me a shout out. Random dude is my other nephew who asked for a shout out. Random dude is is uh. Yeah, that's my other nephew. Oh, yeah. Okay, Random Dude is also my nephew who has his own YouTube channel. His editing skills are actually not terrible. His outro. His, I, dude, it's, he's, he's a young guy, but he's got a good channel. It's fun. Check it out. Um, when and, okay, when oh, wait, you I'm and your... Wait, that's my channel now. Subscribe to Mila's Madness. When, okay, hold on. Phantom Saves is when, when, when... One L, not two Ls. When <laughs> you and your wife have a disagreement, do you go into lawyer mode? No. What do you think? Actually, I, I should not answer that. What do you think? No. I don't think so. I think I, 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 don't, I don't ever go into lawyer mode unless I think one of the children are lying to me. 
You don't lie to me, do you? No. That's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> um, I missed the freezing subject. You want to sit down? Oh, okay, fine, here. Okay. This is carnotzel, by the way. This is a this is a local delicacy. It's delicious. Daddy, you're just talking about the uh, which nephew did you almost kick in the flip video? He is the oldest brother, so he's the which one, one. I didn't almost kick him anyhow. Um, um, uh, Hillel. Hillel. He's a, he was the one who was in the live stream that he asked me to shout him out last time. Uh, I didn't almost kick him, but man, I was trying to do that backflip and get the basketball net into the basketball into the basketball net. It didn't work. Okay, hold on. So uh, James Newland said, James Newland, just keep trying. I missed the freezing subject about the GoPro. I thought it upgraded the firmware, but it didn't go all the way. Okay, well, anyways, uh, GoPro discussion we can have. Uh, oh, Juan Nunez. Juan Nunez says he's the cutest baby, except when he doesn't behave. Then he is not so cute. <laughs> no? <laughs> um, you were trying hard. Good job. That's Whiskey Throttle. Karen V, hello, hello. Uh, Naomi Seely says, am I late? Um, only 50 minutes and 18 seconds late. Yeah, no, sorry, we're, we're, we're going to call it in a few minutes. I said we'd call it in 50 minutes, but if you have him cooperating, uh, give me a shout out, random dude. Am I late? Naomi Seely. Okay, Zero Hour TV, love y'all. Zero Hour, I'll see you on the interwebs. I don't know what this is. Toy. Oh my God, hi guys. Um, good night, cute little family. Heart Rose, <laughs> yeah, Ethan's t-shirt looks like. Dawson's conspiracy shirt. Okay, dude, he's sticking his carnatzel into the container now. Don't do that. Um, so what else was there? Stay tuned. There's going to be some good content coming. Uh, there's going to be some good subjects coming. Tomorrow's video should be fantastic. I need to get my wife's feedback on it and the kids' feedback, and I need to finish editing. I need to get the thumbnails. DSLR, I'll be sending you a couple of pics sooner than later. Uh, okay, kids down. Any one last question? Two, let's just three last questions before we go. I'm not the best dad in the world, but can I still wear, can I still wear your merch? Aussie man, yeah. every dad is the best dad in some respect. Um, love you, DSLR, he's here. Sure, bring it on, okay, good. Whiskey Throttle, stirs for everybody. Viva Fry stirs, oh, see what you did there? Viva Fry stirs. Oh, he's got, oh, come here, show me what you got, show me what you got, come here, come here, come here, let's see this. Uh, okay, he's got he's got a fishing rod. Dude's got a fishing rod down there. That's very okay. bad. His first word was drone. His first favorite sport is gonna be fishing. How's the TV gig going? Oh, Jeremy Anthony. So I'm I was supposed to be on tomorrow morning, but I have to catch a plane, which will not allow me to do it. So the first of the bi-weekly installments is coming January two weeks from tomorrow. Whatever that is. Nineteenth, January nineteenth. Uh, Paul Murray. Dis quelque chose en français. Paul Murray. Ah, on, peut, on peut compléter notre live stream, notre stream en vivant, uh, en français. <laughs> we can finish our live stream in French. Um, how's the non-daily upload been? Uh, comment ça va avec uh, les uh, téléchargements uh, non quotidiens? Oh, that's pretty good, actually. Um, how's it going with the non-daily? It's good. Uh, my problem is compulsion. It's one of avoiding... Paul Murray says merci. <laughs> bienvenue, bienvenue. My problem is one of compulsion. It's one of avoiding the daily upload because I want to do it and actually just waiting. Um, so that's it. That's my problem. Oh, Daddy, when can I do, Daddy, when can I do this video? Because I'm not going to be able to post it. Hi, Doggy. How are you doing? Uh, Till Thursday. We'll worry about that after this live No, because Daddy, on oh, Thursday, you're getting back. <laughs> French, uh, one of them, she speaks well, um, and uh, the other one speaks, is learning it. Need more subs January 21st, two weeks from tomorrow. No, no tomorrow's the 7th, isn't it? Tomorrow's the 7th, 14th, 19th. What's my problem? 21st. It's the 21st. I'm real good at, real good at math. Embarrassing. That's that's up on the internet for an eternity now. Barney, my boy. <laughs> uh, okay. We have to go. We have to go. Everybody, um, we bid thee the peace out to the Frysters as my daughter puts her hand on the screen and I go to end the stream. Bye Thank guys. you very much, everybody, for participating. Thank you. Thank you. It's not.